They've had a wonderful weekend. She said, get in that bush, boy. Get, mm, mm. Oh, mm, mm. oh, it's always that one person. They just going to do their own thing. That's K.A. <laughs> he know parts of the dance, but he don't know the whole thing. Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. You're watching Just a Mom That Sims. I'm KT, and I'm here today with another KT's Horse Ranch Adventure, Adventure, Adventure. <laughs> if you like my content, please think about liking, subscribing, following, commenting, just do all the things. So I'm here with KT. She is grabbing some salad that her son, Joshua, who is right here, made. Joshua is going to do his homework and take a shower. And what they are really getting ready for is today, KT and Jordan are having a vow renewal celebration so let's look at this calendar real quick as i get you up to date we've got that we've got the couple's anniversary tomorrow and then so these will probably be both this episode and next episode will be the wedding event for lena and ka so we got a full calendar for the next few days in the herd household KT is over here and what she's doing is cooking a cake and they're going to take that with them because it's going to be used at the vow renewal ceremony. Jordan is just talking to KT. He's feeling pretty good today, but I am going to have him go ahead and just get dressed a little bit. I'm going to have Joshua come out here. He's been doing a little more duties around the ranch but he is a geek so we did complete part one of the renaissance sim aspiration and we're working on part two the only thing he can really do right now is get that other skill point he can't become an adult and he can only get in a part-time career so they got the cake and this is a modded cake a mango cake so it looks delicious i'm gonna go ahead and pop that in kt's inventory uh she's got so many horse ranch <laughs> uh these medals around here she has gotten the next part of her aspiration jordan needs to make three more bottles of nectar oh my gosh and that will be his whole nectar making aspiration that took a lifetime oh my goodness so that's what he needs to do and i could have him do one before the ceremony but i will not because that is crazy it gets him dirty hey t is here she just needs and this is the last one of hers to place at the ultimate horse championship and so i think she can't do that and that's only on saturdays she can't do it because she accidentally did a competition with our done girl and done is the only one who could do that ultimate horse championship so i'm gonna play at this household until lena and ka get married then i'm gonna move them over to newcrest which i have popped houses in and i got a separate video on that it's giving credit to all the people's houses and things that i use and it shows what i built what i'll do is come back that following saturday to play kt so she can get her goal because jordan is going to get his between today and tomorrow we are here at the vow renewal ceremony what i am going to do is have kt take a photo with jordan they have taken their pictures. Today they have to have speeches, cut the cake, spousal kiss. We're going to ask uh, all of the guests to please take their seats. The guests are here and they are taking their seats. You see Lena over here looking amazing and these are all their friends and father winter's gonna come fully suited up for winter no matter what so hopefully he makes it i can see ka sitting over here in the back here are their friends so hopefully kt and jordan arrive soon they are gonna walk down the aisle oh look at them oh my gosh and they are giggling we have jordan and kt renewing their vows they are getting married they've been together for so many years now they have an adult child and it's just beautiful oh my gosh and look at everybody in the audience they're so happy they've been together so long they've worked through any issues they've had they've always been a team which is the key and looks like jordan is upgrading that ring so hey <laughs> and they are kissing it up and that's the end of their ceremony oh jordan said oh i hurt my back 
<laughs> they are going to seal the deal with a kiss, another kiss. And Jordan wants to show off just a little bit. Yes, he likes physical intimacy. And bam, Jordan said, look, I still got it. To get it to count for the wedding, I have to have KT do the actual spousal kiss. So, oh, I don't think that counts. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so that should check out oh my gosh they are having a hard time maybe they're getting kind of old here with it so ka is giving the toast yes please get your glasses people come get your glasses lena is there she is she's gonna give a toast to they're all giving toast now so this should count i have kt give a toast to jordan i just have everybody give a toast and maybe it'll count at some point oh my gosh the wedding event ended oh my gosh we're gonna cut that cake anyway ka and jo kt and jordan are gonna cut the cake cut the cake lena i have her removed the wedding cake topper i can complete all the stuff in the wedding and it won't end but um today that they are still doing the event, it ends. Take a photo with KA. Wow. Do a wedding group dance over here. See if it works. They've eaten cake. You know, they've had a good time. Hey. KA, KA, get with them. Get with everybody else. Oh, mm -mm. oh. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Mm -mm. Oh. Mm -mm. oh it's always that one person they just gonna do their own thing that's ka <laughs> he know parts of the dance but he don't know the whole thing it's pretty much time to go home oh they're so sweet and this is what's interesting about them they have a bad compatibility score, but they have been best friends since they were children. And I mean, little kids. So they're in love and they're going to get married and we'll see. And this is what makes the Sims interesting. We'll see how that plays out if that affects their relationship any. But as for now, the hearts have had a long day, but they are all home at this time. Lena, who needs to get a writing skill because she did get promoted to an ensemble author. So she's been doing really good, but she does need to get that writing skill up. So what I am going to do is have her just play a round of incredible sports. And then she is going to go ahead and do a fashion blog. And that will help her with her writing skill. They got a buff for two days. Reestablishing a lifetime commitment is a joyous occasion for any Sam. I was just feeling closely connected from close family dynamics and cherishing the advice that Lena gave him. Today is really Sunday. So Sunday Sim time, we have a couple's anniversary event. And it's going to be at the Rusty Horse. Parent Appreciation Day the next day. And Lena and Kay. A's wedding and then we'll do the big move to Newcrest. Jordan is up and the first thing he's gonna do as the ranch hand that he is is she's gonna get over here and refeed the horse feeder. He actually wants to surprise KT. He wants to cook breakfast so he's just going to do some beignets. Jordan is cooking. KT is about to be up so she'll get up and she will just shower and get ready for her day. Jordan is going over to Dead Horse Caverns because there are a few hours left before their anniversary party starts, which is part two to their vow renewal dance challenge. So he's going to go on the offense because he was on it last night. So he defeated the creature. Skeleton leaves forth with the microphone, the rap battle. We're going for the offense. So yeah, there we go, Jordan. KT has... 27 million followers i've got energy nectar in my inventory i believe and it is time for our anniversary kt and jordan are here they have to do a vow renewal this is a modded holiday event jordan scheduled their vow renewal event and kt scheduled this anniversary event jordan did not know anything about it <laughs> i have lena build her writing skills while they are here and i just love their look so after this i'm gonna have kt go ahead and take some photos of them on their anniversary this means that k a is somewhere around <laughs> 
<laughs> they both look good, but KT is wearing this dress. If you don't mind me giving my elder sim self a compliment. <laughs> they renewed their vows out here at Tesno Ridge. I call it the Rusty Anchor from the Golden Girls. So they have to reminisce about their wedding day. I go ahead and get that. We're just going to have a seat out here on the logs. He's remembering how they danced, how they exchanged rings. And Jordan is like, do I remember all this? <laughs> I believe they got married at the Romance Festival. She wants to go ahead and give him a romantic gift. This is going to be a little bit funny, but she's going to give him some prairie grass hay. He is a ranch hand, has a ranch hand trait. What she's going to tell him is, hey, the very first prairie grass hay that you harvested, he loves it. <laughs> she kept the very first prairie grass hay that he harvested. They had to watch a romance together. And, oh, fun fact, Jordan and KT do not have a TV. They've never had a TV. KA is coming to join them. And I just think it's so funny because he acts like he's really their son. And I just want you to see how high KT's relationship is with KA. And Jordan's is not as high even though they hang around a lot. It is just so funny. So they had to make a dessert and that's not going to happen here. I just happened to find this lovely bush back here. Um, by find, I mean I put it there, okay? <laughs> Learn is going to try to get... KT to get a little frisky on their very very first day they came here it was so funny because they ran 5,000 miles to try to woohoo in a bush got all the way there and KT was like no I'm not woohooing on the first day Jordan is like hey girl don't you want to get your woohoo on this lady in the bar in her underwear is like what are we doing they are wrapping up their anniversary <laughs> with a little bush woohoo They've had a wonderful weekend. She said, get in that bush, boy. This is what they have decided to do on their anniversary. I do believe they're supposed to make dessert together. <laughs> but they just want to look around and make sure. Is anybody looking? No, nobody's looking. Oh, George Sleepy. <laughs> I do think this is where we are going to leave off. Until next time, keep sending, be happy, and always have a blessed day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.